there guys, Dex here, and welcome back to another episode of Aspen Diaries. Today is the day we completely redo the area that I've been talking about for a while now. All the way up here. As you can see, it's quite a bit of a big area, so this video is probably going to take a while, but it'll when it when it's like all done and accounted for, then in the next few days, it'll really start to stick out pretty well, honestly. So I'm excited to get started with this. Uh, but first, of course, we're gonna need to do some cleaning up, um, because there is- there are still a lot of flowers there, and also a lot of trees. So I'm thinking we're gonna have to pull some tools out to get ready. And that we can first start off with cutting down all the trees over here, that I planted a while back. And... We're basically just gonna replace them with some other things, basically. So... Yeah. Let's just hope there aren't any bees in that in these trees. Oh, look at that. Rare stump pattern. Always really nice to get those, even if I'm not really going to keep them. So, uh, we got some money there. And, yep, no bees. Perfect. Alright. Alright, and now all we need to do next um, is just pull out our shovel and then dig these up. And then after that, we're going to have to start... Basically, um, getting these flowers out of here and moving them somewhere else. We can use these white and red cosmos for another project in the future. So, yeah. Alright, so all we gotta do now is dig these up. Here we go. That's not what I wanted. I can never really get, at the, get the hang of this, um, of digging stuff up. You saw that in the last episode where I was doing the easy item matching tour and I kept digging in the wrong spots like and it would and it prolonged the game even more because it kept popping up hey do you want to put this away or do you want to keep it and it's like no no it was an accident please that so that was really a little bit annoying so that's why we got to be a bit more careful i would say all right now comes the fun but also kind of well not well now comes the quote fun part of picking up all these flowers and moving them which we're going to have to do a lot of, by the way, picking up and moving stuff. And I don't I don't know if I'd call it fun yet, so... Oh, I completely forgot about that. The fishing tournament is today. Well, we're not really participating in that, because we're doing this instead, but... And besides, I'm not really good at those fishing tournaments. Um, with one specific fish you need to catch. So, during January fishing tournaments, you can only catch... Um, one specific type of fish, and it's usually a sea bass, black bass, carp, crucian carp, barbell steed. I don't know if I said sea bass already yet, but yeah, something like that. Maybe horse mackerel, too. Yeah, those I'm not good at. Like, I swear, like, um, in the one I did last May, um, I caught something really big and it was like, oh yeah, I'm definitely going to win with this, because it was a sea bass fishing tournament. Instead... Um, I'm pretty sure Avery won. Um, from what I remember, he caught one that was just a little bit bigger than mine. Just such a tiny amount bigger than mine that it was just a little infuriating for me. So that's why I don't really participate in these kinds of fishing tournaments anymore. Fishing tournaments that accept all fish, I'm totally good with. But things like this are not so good for me. Alright, so I'm gonna turn this into a time lapse of me picking up flowers because that's just gonna take a while. Okay, so we finally finished planting all the flowers. As you can see, they're all down here, and they're 
very, very all over the place. That's, that's the one way I'll put it. But basically, this entire area over here is now perfectly clean, except for the garden rock we have over here and this one pitfall seat up here. I'm going to keep that pitfall seat up there because in the future it'll definitely be necessary to, so that no other pitfall seats appear in this town. It's very important that I don't accidentally fall into a pitfall. So that kind of takes away that paranoia, I suppose. Okay, now. Let's see here. We're going to go in here and see if Leaf is selling a bamboo shoot. I think I just need one more. Please tell me you're... Please, 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 please tell me you're selling a bamboo shoot. How do you uh, bring a net into a shop and hit whoever's in there with it? Oh, sorry, this isn't Google. Alright, well, pff. of course, Leaf selling a persimmon for the fourth time in a row is super helpful, that's for sure. Okay, we have five bamboo shoots. I was planning on using six, but because Leaf is very, like, I, how do I put this, um, obnoxious? In his sales, I don't have enough now. So now we're gonna have to go in our house and um, get some more supplies. And this is gonna involve uh, cedar trees and bamboo, because you know, I wanna dominate cedar trees over here. Now we're also going to be using uh, holly bushes too. So, or, well, not holly bushes, I always say that. We're gonna be using um, just any kind of bush, really. We're just gonna kinda make the area full of all these bushes and stuff. And it doesn't really matter what ones they are anyway, so... Yeah. Okay, so... Wait. I ha did I have two more of those and I didn't even realize it? Hold on. I think I might have had more of those and I didn't even realize it. The bamboo shoots, anyway. Did I? Huh. Interesting. I thought I did. Okay, well... Yeah! Oh, I do have six! Would you look at that? Okay, I guess I do have six bamboo shoots instead, so you know what? We're good there. Okay, but anyway, as I was saying, we're going to look for some cedar trees, and then we're going to start planting them over the area. Um, actually, we can do the bamboo first, you know what? Since we already have it. And then I might as well just take any saplings, or, you know, bamboo shoots. Or No, I already just took the bamboo shoots, I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, take any other, um, I would say, uh, little sap... No, not saplings. Oh my gosh. Starts. 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 There. I said it. I said the right word. <laughs> that took me way too long. And it's taking me way- And it's also taking me way too long to find these starts. But we're doing good so far. We just need one more and we should be all set. Here we go. Or wait, no. We need one extra more. There we go. Now we're all set. Now all we gotta do is go and um, put these in the area that we're going to. Yep. I'm really hoping all of them grow, because, honestly, I don't want to- I hope- I hope all the bamboo grows anyway, because I don't- I don't want to waste three- I didn't- I don't want to waste any of my 3,000 bells that I spent on it. So, you know. Yeah. Okay, so, again, as I mentioned before, the path's gonna be right next to the river, as opposed to, like, two spaces away. Or the two spaces away that it was, and there are gonna be two new public works projects here, so... I'm planning on putting in a bus stop and a log bench. And we're gonna do the bus stop today, since it's the more... I would say difficult one to put in. I don't know if that makes a whole lot of sense, but you know what? Yeah. Okay. So I'm looking at my guide of what I where I wanted to put things, and for the this next piece of bamboo, I'm gonna go up here one, two, three spaces, and then up one, and this is where I'm gonna put my first bamboo. Yeah, I kind of made a guide for this because I figured it'd be easier to do that. So now we just gotta bury that. And as you can see, it gets a little nice, tiny little bamboo shoot right there. So that's for sure real nice. Okay. And then from here, from where the bamboo is, um, we go one, two. Kind of going to mark this out. So that's three, five. And then down here is seven. Um, but we're going to... Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. We're going to plant it... Um, you know what, I should probably just make this a time lapse because this is going to take a while for me to figure out where, to, where exactly I'm going to plant some of these, so yeah.
Oh my gosh, okay, I think we're all done with actually planting everything we need. And as you can see, this open space right here is going to be our bus stop. Um, so, yeah, alright. So the next thing I'm gonna do is, well, really, since I'm just gonna drop these right now, uh, the other things I have in my pockets, and what we're gonna do next is we're gonna get the flowers necessary for the actual project. And you're gonna see just how many flowers I'm talking about when I actually get down to the beach. Because I already I'm, I already kind of showed you in the last video, but, um, yeah. It's quite a lot. Just gonna, just gonna say outright right now, it's gonna be quite a lot. You can already kind of see them down there. But, yeah. Once I go down there, I'm gonna take a little look around, and... Yup. That's a lot of flowers, and the the kicker is, it might not actually be enough. Yep, you heard that right, they might not actually be enough. But right now we're just gonna pick them up, and we gotta carry them all the way there, and all the way, and we have to go back and pick up more and stuff. And just so you know, this project, it's, I think it's already been about 25 minutes since I started this. Wow. So yeah. Alright, so let's get to planting these flowers. Oh my gosh, okay, so we're all done placing flowers now, and that took an insane amount of time. Currently, it's 9.38, and I started this project around, yeah, the beginning of 9 a.m., so yep, this is definitely a bit of a long project, but we're in the home stretch now. All we gotta do now is set up one of the Public Works projects, and we're basically done for the day with the project. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna set up the log bench and pay for it, and then that'll be it for that. So first of all, we gotta go talk to Isabel. And 
get the bus stop ready. I've been waiting to use one of those for a while anyway. All right. So let's go sit in our official chair of business. She's probably gonna ask us to go to a ceremony. Yeah, I kind of outright forgot that Isabel refuses to let you work uh, as a mayor on an event day. So even if I'm not participating in that event, I cannot put down a public works project until tomorrow, which means this is going to be delayed a little bit more than I was expecting. So yeah, so I guess this um, part actually is it for today's video. So yeah. Um, as you can see, it is looking pretty nice. I mean, it looks a little small right now because no public works projects, uh, spaces, and these haven't fully grown yet, so they just kind of look like plants along with the flowers, but by the time I would say February 25th hits, these will be, or no, not February 25th, January 25th hits, these should be looking real nice, real grown, and it should be a lot better looking than it is right now. And I gotta run back and forth across this area here because, um, I gotta get the grass work going. This is a- I'm not gonna put a path here. It's gonna be natural grass work, so I kinda gotta run back and forth here quite a bit in order to get that going. As you can see, the grass work from where the original path was, right on top of me right there, kinda, is still kinda healing, so kinda gotta wait for that, but yeah. That's basically the whole gist of the project, and hopefully it should be all grown by the time the next video hits. So yeah, thank you guys for watching, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe if you would like, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye